Flights are canceled and commercial shipping is being redirected after China fired missiles near and over Taiwan for the first time in nearly 30 years. The move comes after Speaker Nancy Pelosi visited and met with Taiwan's president. Let's bring in ABC News national security and defense analyst Mick Mulroy for more. Uh, Mick, Taiwan strongly condemned China for launching these missiles, comparing the Chinese government to North Korea and demanding that China, quote, exercise self-restraint. What do you make of that response? So I think it's a reasonable response. This is this is the Chinese retaliation for Speaker Pelosi's visit to the island. It looks to me like it's a rehearsal for a potential blockade of the island as the exercise encircles the entire island. Uh, near term, I would look for whether Chinese surface vessels go past the 12 nautical mile limit and see what the Taiwanese do. Long term, if they do in fact ever blockade the island, what would that do to the U.S. ability to help support uh, Taiwan militarily. So what's China's motivation with this show of force? What's their play right now? I think they're trying to send the message that this exercise, which is enormous uh, and, and, uh, and, and substantial, uh, does show that they have the capability to uh, blockade the island. And that is incredibly uh, important, not only to uh, the Taiwanese, but uh, the world economy, as they are so critical to so much of the high technology that the world now uh, relies on when it comes to microchip. How do you think this trip by Pelosi will impact U.S.-China relations, and, and how does what's happening between Russia and Ukraine impact that as well? So that is to be determined. If this exercise ends without a confrontation, uh, and the U.S. is able to convince the Chinese that we have not changed our one China policy, which we have not, uh, then I think it, it will have an impact, but it can be mitigated through uh, diplomacy. Uh, if it's not the case, and the Chinese now look for at this as an opportunity to take more aggressive steps, it could, of course, elevate. And to your point on uh, how does uh, Ukraine impact this, I think China can see that just how significant the U.S. military support for Ukraine has been against uh, uh, Russia uh, in, in the support of uh, the Ukrainians. So they see that the, the ability of the United States to provide advanced weapon systems uh, to Taiwan could be a critical factor if they ever decide to do an invasion of that island and, and enforce it into compliance with their uh, government. All right, Mick Mulroy, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.